What's good, world? That dude, Sean P. with Intervision TV. And we back again with another interview. I got my man, Tamale Savage, out here. Yeah, yeah. You feel yo, me? Yo, yo, yo. Forest City General, we out here. You yeah. feel me? I'm Let's glad y'all boys can come out here and rock with us for a second. You dig? Before we get in this mm -hmm. Q&A, I'm going to let them let me tell you who they are and where they from, what they represent, man. Give the people a run. Yeah, you know, I'm Tamale Savage, man. You know, your peppy, man. I'm from Pine Hills, Silver Star, 438. You feel me? Born down in Miami, so yeah, you feel me? I'm doing it music. I've been doing it, I'm on it, it's time, so we rocking, you feel me? And I got my own slash management, Four City with me, the general, you feel me? That way. So, give the people a rundown of your musical background. Musical background? It always been in my family, in my life, you feel me? I've been doing music since, what, 2003, 2004, you feel me? So, I've been doing my thing out there. Um, Person, you remember when they had the next tail phone? You feel me? The church phone. You feel me? They'll go to J Mart, the nail for real, and put my songs on the church phone, and everybody in my hood. Yeah, the ringtone. Yeah, before it even even got there, and that's what got it popping. You feel me? And they always called me Snap, and the little cipher would gas up and rap, and they like, boy, you snapping. So in the streets, the streets know me as Snap, you feel me? Because I've always been snapping, you feel me? But now I'm taking it serious. I left the trouble alone. I'm trying to take it serious. And, you know, and we're going to do it. It's going to work. You feel me? What? You got any shows on here? Shows? Shows. Miami, I'm out there also. Yeah, yeah. But I was in Miami. I was in Miami when I was younger. So, um, at Cleo's. Uh, 2016, that was okay, about, right. about two years ago, okay. and then yeah. um, then that same weekend you did, went to Miami, and did so and Alabama with Papa Duck. Oh, that's real. Papa yeah, Duck. yeah, yeah. I went with Papa Duck um to Alabama. That was the first show okay. Memorial Weekend. You feel me? So we did Friday, Saturday up in Alabama, right. and we stopped in Orlando, did Cleo's. Right, so you know, then we went to Miami. I forgot what the club was called down there, but um DJ Daffy, he the one that had the thing going. He invited me, so. Okay. Yeah, we we was rocking that. We was rocking that. Right, right, right. I did so. I did so. I had a show at um up at Lit. You feel me? They were they were breaking my music in that too. You feel me? Yeah, yeah. One time for Melo. We got some things coming. So um, how do you describe? How you would you describe your style? Like, my style. Who are you? Man, I'm me. I'm gonna be real. First and foremost, I'm me. You feel me? But. I got a uh, a diverse style, you feel me? Like I can I can rap, I can sing, you feel me? Um, I'm different. I'm not trying to put on all that gangster right. image like everybody else trying to put on. Cause behind the scenes, when the cameras off, we living life, you feel me? But but my style is different, you feel me? And I feel like my style is more like when I write my music, I compete with what rappers that's out there versus trying to compete locally and you know ride the local wave you feel me i embrace the local wave you feel me but i'm trying to be a little over that what, what, what kind of some of, what are some of your musical influence like who, who, who you grew up listening to well, i grew up yeah, listening to ready to rap starters um who got me ready to rap yeah who got you getting like i'm, I'm rocking with buddy man he inspired me I'm oh, oh um of course uh rick ross you right. feel me because he was holding down florida right. you feel me uh a little a little splash of plies but not right. really um <laughs> migos you feel me i like i like jose guapo like what i listen to right now it'll be jose guapo uh, something like that you feel me cola p okay. you feel me but these, these are the most recent rappers you feel me okay. but back in the day man um uh, the radio bro i ain't really okay. i was too young to really listen. With it, you yeah it. you feel me yeah, but I, I went to juvenile program, and I, I was a like I said earlier, I was a bunky with Bruno Mali kid. Right. I used to call him Spook. I always freestyle when I was younger. Okay. When me and bro was in there, we were cleaning shit up and Good. writing music, yeah. and we always said, bro, we gonna do this music. And now he signed the MMG. Slide, you feel what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, Zo Slide. You feel me? So that was my that was my motivation to because I almost left it alone. Then I resurfaced. I'm like. Damn, I forgot 
basically the pack that we made down way back then yeah. when we was younger then. So I'm like, man, I'm gonna do this music again. So where I'm coming from, you feel me? And a nigga gonna feel where I'm coming from, you feel me? If you uh if you could collaborate with any artist, whether it be two artists or artists, period, but I guess more so the of the state. Of the state. Locally, statewide. Damn. I, I say. We fuck with everybody. Like We fuck with everybody in the city, city state, country, whatever you are. Yeah. Yeah. That's real. Yeah. Whoever, whoever yeah. want to do some feature, with whatever, whatever. Yeah, yeah we're going we gonna to do it. Right like, up. and that, 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 that's the ultimate. Yeah, you feel me? Nah, yeah, right. you feel yeah, me? Sure. Yeah, that, that, that's what it is. So, um, what are some of the, uh, like, where do you get some of your, the, 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 uh, what's the word I'm looking for? The, uh, the passion or something like that? Not just the passion, but like, yeah. what gives you the energy to be like, you know, I'm going to write about this particular thing. Like, where you, where you draw your energy from in your music? From, from what I've, what I've lived and been through. Okay. You feel me? Um, almost losing my life to the system of being dead. Period. Okay. You feel me? Um, from my homies. You feel me? Like four thirty eight, nine oh two. The lifestyle, how them boys living. Mm -hmm. You know, we around the same age, but I kind of left that street stuff alone. But I still like get my influence from certain things that they doing. You feel me? So I know, man. Hey, I can write about this or talk about this and make a hit and I, I wouldn't even deprive myself of making that hit because yeah. maybe I don't got this or got that you feel me or whatever at that particular moment you feel me I still I still make music you feel me okay. yeah and um I actually I mean I, the rhythm and I've been playing African drums all my life you oh, feel me you just, you yeah 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 my uncle he played the steel pans and the drums okay. you feel what I'm saying I got I got family that's played in movies you know uh, my, my uncle Jim so played in yeah, as a being somebody, I always was motivated to as I'm going to be somebody. Like my cousin, he played on Gullah Gullah Island on Nickelodeon. Okay. You feel me? His dad played on my brother and me. Uh, you feel me? And those... So you just feel like it's just actually that's just a part of the family, part of the bloodline. That greatness. Greatness or greatness, being right. somebody or doing something is definitely a part of the family. Uh, you feel me? So I just got to get in where I fit in and I know how much I love music. Mm -hmm. You feel me? And... I feel like that's gonna be my market to lead to me doing movies or shows or okay. you feel me being a comedian or so you feel me. Let, let, you know what? Let's talk about music right now. What, yeah. What, 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 what you got coming out right now? What, maybe talk about some of your projects. Oh, uh, right now I got not up for debate, man. Not up for debate. My last project was nigga never gave me nothing. Okay. You feel me? But not up for debate is next. It's coming and within the next couple of months. You feel me? I got singles like on them, two hundred shots okay. on there. Ouija. You feel me? Watch, I'm singing on Ouija, you feel me? Um, it's a lot of hot tracks or records on there that they are like in the club, in the streets. A female can play. Any, you feel me? Anybody can like it. Whoever relate. Anybody can relate to it. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. That's real. All right. I'm, I'm going to hit you with a, a throwback. This is Thursday. Throwback Thursday. I want you to think about your first song you ever wrote. You feel me? Was it, was it a hit or, or was it like, yeah. I messed this in? Yeah, Gangsta in the Chevy. It was a hit. It was a hit on um, 2003, four, like I told you about the next tail phone. Yeah, all right. Them boys, everybody had that. Uh -huh. We keep it gangsta in the Chevy. Uh -huh. Yeah, everybody played that. And then the next hit I had was um with Crucial Crucial and uh Louis Bag. They call him Trap Hamilton. Now. We had okay. a song called G Swag. Right, G Swag, that was popping. You feel me? But I went, I was too young, I went at the level till I knew what I had. So I went in the club trying to, you feel me? But in the hood. Everybody, they check out my G swag. A nigga call me and just sing my song, like you feel me. So that that was the hit though, and that's the uh, first hit. Period. You feel me? Okay. That was one of the first hits. Period. You feel me? Let's talk about some of your your goals for for the rest of this year. You got a couple months in this year, really. Would you? For the rest of this year, man. My goal, man, is just to keep keep bringing it, keep bringing it, man, and um. Just not letting up, not stopping, you know, keep hustling, trying to stay consistent, keep okay. grinding, you feel me? Stay in the studio, stay doing interviews or something like this, you feel me? This ain't the first or the last, stay moving, you feel me? Because if you're on that football field, you stay moving, what are you going to get? You're going to get to the end zone, you feel me? Yeah. So, right, what's your hottest song to you right now? 
I'm ready to rock and this is what get me popping every time I put this song that belong to me. Yo. Yeah. On the limb. On the limb? On the limb. What's the story behind it? On the limb, um it's basically speaking about um like things you'll do to feed your feed your baby, you feel me? What risk that you'll take, you feel me? I'm rapping on it. Yeah, to take care of your family, you yeah. feel what I'm saying? And like one thing I say was like talking to a slim got me feeling like soldier. Okay. You feel me? I rep the uptown like, you know, for a city down to North Hawassi. Okay, you feel cool. me? Which is still Pine Hills, uh -huh. but I say uptown, you feel me? I'm from the north side of Orlando. Okay. Basically that's what it is. You feel me? So I say uptown Orlando is more like the know you, you feel me, whoop the whoop. But on a limb I always get me started every time. Like every day I wake up, I play on a limb. I jam that, you feel me? Drink some coffee, smoke me a cigarette, you feel me, and get my day started. Yeah, 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 on a limb, man. That shit be rocking. It's gonna be in the club soon. That's the first thing I'm gonna release. On a limb. You feel me? That's gonna be in the club, yeah, man. Right. Yeah, yeah. Definitely yeah. But um you got you probably you got there's a young boy out here, uh, or even a young lady out here, but they trying to get in the game and they having little issues and you know they feeling discouraged you got some words of encouragement for them? shouldn't be no issue you feel me shouldn't be no discouragement you feel me it shouldn't be none of that you got to believe in yourself you your biggest fan yeah. you feel me and as much as you embrace yourself and love yourself with what the fuck you doing people gonna follow suit you feel what i'm saying but if they see you playing if they really deal with you or mess with you i'm gonna try not to cut mm -hmm. but they gonna tell you bro hey you playing, what are you doing? You feel what I'm saying? So that's just, that's just you know, what I got to say on that. You feel me? You got to believe in yourself. You feel what I'm saying? Don't get discouraged. Keep pushing stuff out. Know what you're doing is fine. You're not dropping it for no reason. You feel what I'm saying? And once you realize all of that, then you set. You feel me? And everything else going to fall in place. Okay, that's real. That's real. Yeah. I like that right there. Um, for your fans out here, people that support you. Is there anything you want them to know that they might not know about you? Well, first thing I want to give a shout out, got down on the bags over bullshit. Y'all go follow Fee Boy on Instagram. His name Fee McLovin, M C L O V I N. You feel me? Got me piffed up. You feel what I'm saying? But um, what was that question again? Like anything you want to tell your fans that they don't know about you? That they don't know about me? I ain't gonna lie, like really, a lot of people be flexing, bro. A lot of people know about me, bro. They already know. They know a lot about me, bro. You feel me? Like, and it's crazy. You feel me? It's like, it's like that type of know to where, like, they see me on this way, they go this way. Like, let me go that way. <laughs> what about the fans that don't know you like that? Fans that don't, yeah. fans that don't know me. Oh, man, I'm a cool dude, man. I'm a funny dude. You feel me? I'm, I'm, I'm a happy dude. I work. I handle my business. I try to take care of my family, you feel me? And I feel like all y'all should do the same, you feel me? The music is gonna be lovely. Everything, like, if you know me or don't know me, y'all know what it is and the potential of everything. So everything will just be falling into place, you feel me? As far as all my fans and stuff like that. Um, Since we reaching out to the fans, let them know how yeah. to find you on social media. Or any yeah, um, your music. Your music I got page. two Instagram pages. I got a street page and I got a business page, okay? Mm -hmm. so. Um, Tamale, T-A-M-A-L-I, underscore savage, you feel me? Then I got original, underscore, 438, you feel me? Y'all can find me there, y'all can contact me on that, you feel me? Features, I will not bust y'all head, I want everybody to eat, you feel me? Y'all check out my music first if y'all willing to do all that, you feel me? I got a uh, Facebook and I'm, I'm building a Twitter account. Okay. It's Tamale Simon on Facebook. I'm building up my Twitter account, I ain't really jumped on that yet, you feel me? YouTube is Tamale Savage, T-A-M-A-L-I. Yeah, you can get to my music on YouTube, you feel me? Everything, anytime it's ready, video, song, it's gonna go to YouTube when it's being released, you feel me? Yeah. Well, um, yeah. You got oh, man, I just did something for the kids, man. Oh, Koi Bulldogs, you feel me? Yeah. Koi Bulldogs, one time for them boys, man, them young boys, they just beat Pine Hill Saturday, you feel me? I did a song for them, you feel me? And a video, I in a video, I did yeah, a song. Then, right yeah, the pop one of the yeah, team yeah. out in the club, man. For the youngest, man. For the youngest, man. We gotta take care of the youth, man. And that that's that's a big motivation for myself is I'm always gonna be like that. If I do pop with this music, I wanna open up rec centers for the youth. You feel me? And put studios in there and give them the opportunity from young to be able to chase their dream and their talent. You feel me? Not only with the music but sports, of course. You feel me? Whatever it is, yeah. And that's what I'll be doing, you feel me? That's why I want to be somebody to do that, you feel me?
That's what's up, man. That's yeah. what's up. Hey, you rocking with the youngins out here, man. Yeah, man, it's all right. Yeah. You did. yeah. Uh, Mr. General, yeah, man. let the people know how they can find you, bro. Y'all already know where to find you, boy. Four City Road. Every day, all day. Six days, 54 City Road. Hit me up on IG, FC underscore General underscore. Y'all already know where to find me. Not up for the bait, man. Y'all be on the lookout for that. Um, around yeah, class time. Yeah. Um, somebody savage finna blow these streets up. I'm talking about. Yeah. And, and we ain't on no hate shit. I'm talking about we, we ready to work with whoever. We got studio. We ready to do whatever, however. Email us. Yeah. Whatever you gotta yeah. do. I'm talking about. And this comes from, yeah, this comes from somebody who deal with all type of music. You all feel right. me? He, he sells CDs and DVDs. So if you need to do his movie out, Y'all come holla at the general. Hey, y'all gotta rock with the city, cause we out here, man. Yeah. You dig me? Yeah, we good. Cause 438. Y'all already know. Yeah. You dig, you dig. Well, y'all already yeah. know how y'all can find me. It's Sean P. IG, Indivision TV, uh, Indivision Entertainment. Y'all can catch us on Facebook at Indivision TV. You can catch me on Facebook at Sean Parker. But with that being said, what you think I'm trying to say, bro? Yeah, I wanna say, man, um, Man, I came a long way, man. It's a lot of folks I done ran into with the business game. Like we were talking about earlier about yeah. Birdman, Schooly, Rollo, mm -hmm. like, like I said, Bruno Miley, you feel me? G Rock, he's assigned to the Brit Squad. Mm -hmm. uh, that's Deborah Anthony Nephew. I got a song called New York Minute with him. You feel me? Um, I just seen Glock 9 just the weekend. Yeah. Glock 9, which is the new hottest rapper in the O, you feel me? Which I, I respect that he's doing his thing, you feel me? Chris Johnson, KT, like I done, I done met a lot of different people, you yeah, feel me? Perks, bro. Yeah, hard work, putting hard work. Yeah, exactly, yeah. you feel me? So with that being said, um, I just want to tell the fans and everybody, man, it's possible, you feel me? Once you believe on what you're doing and you do it, you feel me? Even Tony Boy, like Tony Boy, I see him, in, I see him in the hood. Yeah, you feel me? Bro, good money, you feel me? Nigga, see him in the hood, like on a regular day at the gas station. Oh, what's good, bro? Hello, yeah, bro, bro, you feel me? Ooh. So, yeah. That anything is possible, man, if y'all just clear your mind out, clear out the bullshit, Focus. chase a bag, you feel what I'm saying? And shit, man, that shit gonna pop, man. That shit gonna work for y'all, man, no matter what y'all trying to do. Black owned businesses, whatever, you gotta support each other, you feel me? Really, you just gotta support your people in general, you feel me? Put the guns down, all that, you feel me? And, and just live your life right, you feel me? You can't say no, you can't say no better, bro. Yeah. You feel me? Again, we appreciate yeah. you coming out here, my G. Yeah. You feel me, Mr. Forest City General? Yeah. You know it's all good, B. You feel me? Again, we out of here. Sean P. Yeah. Rock with us in the Vision TV. Yeah. yeah.